What's going on, Gem Fam? Mike, Ray, yo people. So we want to give a, a video kind of a, of the vision of the gym. So this has been a seven-year-old business and it's evolved as most things will evolve. Um, we've done a bad job of communicating the goal of this business, like the overall goal of the business, not just our products, not just who we work with, but the actual goal of the business, because there is a goal. And um, personally, it's just, for, like, it's just it's felt like, like personal goals. Um, we haven't really communicated it into the business model and we wanna share it with you and what we're doing about it. So the main goal is to serve as many people as possible, right? So that's, any, any good business does that, but um, we, we want to work with Special Olympics and grow a fair opportunity. Um, not, not Special Olympics, the actual 501c3, the Special Olympics. We want to work with special needs communities and create actually fair opportunities. I worked with Special Olympics for a long time and it's not fair. It's very political. A lot of the athletes that do want to be athletes, they're, they're, they've got some rules that are very easy to change and they just won't change it out of the convenience for their operation. Very annoying. So we want to create that opportunity. And if you don't know, um, we've helped to sponsor 39 kids in third world countries for schooling, for three meals a day. And like outreach is a big part of this gym. And we don't really talk about it a lot because honestly, this is still kind of like COVID startup and we just have a lot of work to do on stuff. So I think that's something we've done a, we've done a poor job of doing. So we want to tell you now. Um, I guess you want to tell them about the, the paint product? Yeah, so uh, uh, right now what we really want to focus on and our main, uh, one of our main visions right now is uh, uh, just focusing on the pain-free uh, protocols. Uh, um, so right now what we're doing is just focusing on just, again, helping the most people that we can just live uh, uh, and just honestly just um, be there to help more people at the end of the day. Yeah. And so uh, there's a lot of misinformation out there uh, when it comes to uh, not only training, but also, again, obviously how to treat pain uh, and how to treat discomfort like, you know, during your training programs. And so we want to uh, go beyond uh, and teach you uh, beyond what the market is uh, teaching you right now or what, you know, scrolling on Instagram is teaching you uh, right now. And so, um, yeah, what else we got? Damn these influencers. Yeah, so with that product, it's um, it's gonna be a little product, and you'll you'll click, you'll have a member portal, you click the red dot, because like for example, this elbow pain is different than this elbow pain is different than this elbow pain. You treat it differently, but it's marketed as elbow pain. So we want to make those differentiations for you, so you don't really have to think about it at a super low cost. So that's the first big thing we're doing. Um, we are working with Special Olympics currently. If you didn't know, we've got seven Special Olympics athletes that are that actually have competed in everything. They're they're fun, but we want to grow that into a bigger opportunity. Yep. The other big thing we have coming is um, it's an actual EMG test. Ilya is the friggin' man. If you know Ilya, he's tattooed from here down. I think everywhere. <laughs> I don't. I can't confirm. To the good. He's got a lot of tattoos. He's a, he's a Russian man. He's a professional fighter for 19 years. One of the nicest guys I've ever met in my life. And is a student of the strength game. He loves performance. So one thing I've always been personally enthusiastic about is how do we achieve maximum performance? That led me into therapeutic knowledge and that's continued into the performance side. So in EMG studies, they stick little little needles in your muscles and they see what uh, how much muscle is firing, what percentage of your muscle is firing. We have that study that is, um, that's gonna be started pretty soon. We're gonna mark it and kind of cat call 16 lifters um, March 30th on our powerlifting meet. So with that product, what we wanna do is educate you on how to properly strength train and audit yourself. So we run into the problem of lifters not being able to afford real good coaching. You know, coaches, a coach's market is anywhere from like 150 to 350 a month for, for a good coach. Um, 150 being, you should be charging more probably. Um, but lifters can't pay that all the time. So we're gonna develop probably a personal certification, a personal trainer a certification through it. <laughs> Falafel. <laughs> but we're gonna we're gonna have another one where you can learn how to uh, basically self critique and self program at ten dollars a month. That's gonna be coming later, hopefully this year, potentially next year. But the pain free protocols one is now. And if you guys read the email, um, we're having some issues commercial lease wise right now. If you know anybody that is in pain, I don't care. We're actually gonna make a run specifically at pickleball. Um, if you can help somebody, why wouldn't you? Personally, I've been too focused on power lifters, performance athletes, professional athletes, fighters. Mm -hmm. That's where I came from. That's what I know. But th that level of knowledge is transferable to the general public. And this business is here to help and to serve, bottom line. Not serve fighters, serve powerlifters, to serve. Whatever population that comes into here for help, we want to be able to fu be fully equipped to help them at any price point. 
Um, so these scalable products are the ones we would super appreciate a referral on. If you know anybody that, that has elbow pain, knee pain, post back surgery, I mean, literally this stuff is safe enough that anyone can use it and it's going to be $15 a month on the presale. Yep. So I guess that kind of like, that kind of ends the video. Yeah, um, that wraps it up. Yeah. We just want to be more transparent about what, what we want to do with this business. How can we further help you? And then this is the vision you're pouring into is the special Olympics and the third world kids. Like that's, that's kind of like the, the end goal. Like, of course we're going to lift, we're going to have fun. It's going to be a sick environment. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a little old school. That's the brand. But at the end of the day, the bottom line is helping people that cannot help themselves. That includes people that are being taken advantage of sales wise with misinformation in the industry. That includes people with a, some sort of learning disability, a mental handicap, something like that. And that includes kids in Africa in Haiti and South America that like, like this, that's what, that's what a backbone is. Like you, you got to help people. That's, that's where this started. Um, not that we've lost sight of that, but we we haven't shared that with you guys. Right. So that's what we want to do. And that's what's up. That's what's up. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do it, but we ain't going to do it without you. <laughs> so We want you. We want you to tell people that help me help you. <laughs> so if you know literally anybody in pain, if they can afford a more expensive product, cool. We're happy to help them there. Yep. But honestly, if... If they're just in a little bit of pain, like this is something everyone can use. We, we could target office jobs, but people in your office, like they got tendinitis, you know, someone on an ice pack when they're typing or their mouse hand, like little things like that. Just help them. Just literally help them. That's all it takes. If you have any questions, you can reach out to Mike. You can reach out to myself at any point. If you have any concerns with anything, we're not going anywhere. We're not going anywhere. Nope. It's just really tight and we just, a hand would help. So um, we love you guys and we will be more transparent in the future and let's get freaking strong, y'all. And pain free. Yeah. And pain free. That was a solid ending. Yeah. <laughs>